This episode of Joe Genius is brought to you by Gamefly. Go to Gamefly.com slash Genius for your free trial membership. And GoDaddy.com. Is it a good idea to microwave this? Ahoy! Let's sail through the internet science lab of the seas. This is Revision 3's Joe Genius. Hey you, welcome to Joe Genius, where backyard science goes big time. I'm Joan Array. Now microwaves, they're great for heating up my TV dinner and then reminding me I'm all alone. But on a high note, we have some backyard scientists who are taking microwaves and giving them a whole new purpose. One, two, three, go. Whoa! <laughs> An airbag in a microwave? That is the most brilliant idea I've ever heard. <laughs> oh, no more door! <laughs> Passenger airbags are better than driver airbags. You know, I don't know what came first, the chicken or the egg, but I do know that I get in a lot less trouble putting an egg into a microwave. Welcome to Cooking with Ray, and you put the camera down. We got an egg, and um, we're gonna put it in the microwave. What the hell, it's rolling around in there. You can't see it, but it, it's rolling. Damn new microwaves. Oh my god. I hope the container doesn't melt. Oh my god! Oh my! Oh my god! Ah, the incredible and now not so edible, unless you want to get sick, A. And trust me, I'm not the only one blowing up some embryos. Is the microwave okay? I mean, how are we supposed to make all our Hot Pockets now? All right, here's the deal. When you press the start or popcorn button on a microwave, the magnetron inside emits radiation. And that's basically just really energetic radio waves. Those waves oscillate at 2.5 billion times a second, causing water molecules in your food to vibrate rapidly too. And that's what generates the heat. Unfortunately for these geniuses, some things don't really microwave well at all. When you put metal in a microwave, electricity builds up at the edges to create a spark, in essence, a short circuit, which can lead, of course, to fireworks and other disastrous but somewhat cool-looking results. Hawaiian scientist Derek Fukuhara has taken his microwave experiment photography inside the belly of the beast. Apparently, looking through the glass door just wasn't enough, and he will nuke just about anything. This DVD is done. Hey, I'd like to take a minute to thank our sponsor, GoDaddy. Are you looking to drive viewers to your video content? Then get a .tv domain name and stand out from the crowd. TV domains are perfect for podcasters, video bloggers, anyone with anything to say, really. And they're all available now at GoDaddy.com. And remember, you can download GoDaddy's free iPhone, Android, or BlackBerry app to order right from your phone or manage your current account. Check out Revision3.com slash GoDaddy for a list of all the amazing GoDaddy deals from Revision3. Also, type in Genius8 and get 10% off any order. Be a genius. GoDaddy.com. And now, a carrot, a piece of metal, a paper plate. Together, they're known as the Carrot O Doom. The Jeez. Carrot and um, piece of metal. It's paper. Whoa. Give it time. It acts as a conducting with a piece that sticks up. Mm -hmm. And then the carrot, mm -hmm. which is right now hissing, mm -hmm. acts as a hiss, acts as a chamber. Once it dries out, it becomes a great chamber. Don't worry about the carrot's hissing. If it explodes, I'll clean it up. <sighs> it's a flaming carrot! <laughs> it's a light bulb carrot, okay? <laughs> 
Come on, give me one more flash. Boom. <laughs> Sweet. So much destruction, so little time, you guys. And our microwaves are getting filthy. Let's just try and clean it up with some soap. Just press start. You need a microwave safe plate and your bar of soap. Put it right in the middle there and you stick it in the microwave. Set it on high for about two minutes. Now ivory soap is different than nearly all other soaps. It's famous for floating. The same reason it floats is the same reason it turns into this soapy souffle when microwaved. During the manufacturing process, air is whipped into the ivory soap, and those air pockets contain water molecules. So when they're zapped in the microwave, the water turns into bubbles. Here's where a famous concept called Charles's Law comes in, otherwise known as Chachi's Law, which states that as the temperature of a gas increases, so does its volume. Those air molecules in the soap move fast in the heat, and when they start to move away from each other, poof, the soap fluffs up, expanding enormously and giving your microwave the best cleaning it's ever had. Hey, I have an idea. Let's put a light bulb in a microwave. That's like radiation clashing with glass and wires and stuff. Is it a good idea to microwave a giant light bulb? Yeah, I don't know about that. Um, I'm gonna say yes. Go for it, dude. You want it? Oh! oh wow. <laughs> it's a rainbow all at once. Next 4th of July, folks. Four of those in a microwave. That is so bright. <laughs> we need welding masks, folks. <laughs> yeah, I'm oh. scared. Wow. That is, wow, that is like looking into the sun. I don't actually see, it looks like it, it probably still works. I doubt that. Uh, yeah. Okay, yeah, you fried it. You yeah. Fried it. Good work. And now, intrepid viewers, it's time for a Nikola Tesla moment. Among his many accomplishments, Tesla experimented with a plasma lamp, basically a glass ball filled with gases like xenon and krypton and neon. Check out what happens when you bombard that gas with radiation. It's pretty freaking sweet. So the gas inside the bulb is ionized, meaning that its electrons are knocked loose. These electrons get all excited and they emit photons, which is that cool light you see. All right, so the Joe Genius Award is coming up in a bit, but first I wanna thank our sponsor, Gamefly. Gamefly is the largest online video game rental service that offers you a choice from over 7,000 new and classic titles across all consoles and handhelds. With plans starting at $15.95 a month, Gamefly members can rent one to four games at a time and keep them as long as they like. There are no late fees or due dates, and shipping is always free. Once you're done playing a game, you can send it back and Gamefly will send you the next one on your list. If you really like the game you're playing, simply click on Keep It on the Gamefly website, and the game is yours at a discounted price. Gamefly will even mail you the case and manuals free of charge. Do you have friends that will do that? Probably not. Joe Genius fans get a 15-day free trial when they go to Gamefly.com slash genius. Be one and go to Gamefly.com. All right, everybody, it's that time of the show where we like to award the best of the best. This one is tough. There are so many cool microwave scientists out there, but only one can get the Joe Genius Award. All right, I tabulated my one vote, which is the only one that counts, and the winner is... Kenny Irwin for microwaving that giant plasma bulb. Congrats, Kenny, for your mad microwaving skills. I hope there's more clips from you in the future. And a special <laughs> shout out goes to Percy Spencer for inventing the microwave. I bet he never thought it would become a kitchen staple signifying laziness. Well, microwaving it up for all of you, I'm Jonah Ray, and it's time for me to go heat up my leftover TV dinner. Goodbye. Joe Genius is brought to you in part by the National Science Foundation.